to another video. Um, this is a short video, but it tells you how to add a member section to your site. And the first thing I've done is made a basic uh, MVC application from the file new uh, project. I did uh, framework for web and MVC 3 application. That's all I have done so far. And what you get is this, the basic home page, tab, and about. And by default you get this link at the top right so you can log into your site. Um, you get a registration link and you can make up your user, your password, and all that. Register and you'll log in right away. Uh, I already done this portion, so I'll go here and log in or log on. So it takes you to the home page, nothing fancy, but it does give you, it knows who you are. But the idea for this video is to show how to add another tab in between or after, or it doesn't matter. Uh, this is one video of many about MVC. I'll be trying to uh, work with um, uh, Twitter, how we can tweak from this site or from your own application. And the idea is to practice MVC, a uh, new framework. And we're going to be using Twitter or sending tweets to that site. So, anyways, I'm going to log off and I want a member tab in between here so what you do is you go to the views uh, share folder and you go into the site master page uh, as you can see I already wrote it down here so what you do is <clears throat> pass your what you're gonna show in the tab the action that you're taking uh, and what controller is taking over or who is serving your your link so I'm gonna save it uh, this is your master page so basically what does it does it will add the tab and <clears throat> that's about it on this side the next thing you need to do is you go into your controllers the home controller and as you can see I already have the code ready for you so you don't have to watch me type and one key thing is that you add this line uh, to your action result <clears throat> and as you can see I, I, what I done is just copy and pasted this name it member and I added this attribute as you can see represents an attribute that is used to restrict access by colors to an action method. So users can call the member action, but they have to be authorized or authenticated. So that's about it. Save it. I'm gonna build it. Oh, before I do that, once you do this action, if you right click on this guy on the action you can add you must add a view if you don't follow this step it's gonna fail give you errors uh, like URL not found so you can add view this way or if you haven't done, if you can do it the other way is go into your views your home and add it that way you can go here and add view and name it member but the easiest way is just to uh, right click add view that's the easiest way instead of all this going all over the place after you do that um, Visual Studio will create a member page ASPX page and render whatever text you want back So I'll close this guy and build now. Build successful. So now I'm gonna go back here and I'm gonna refresh. As you can see, I got the tab. I added it on the master page. 
but when I let's see when I click everything works as it should when I click members um, it should ask to authenticate first so this is a nice feature really simple just by adding this attribute it will ask to authenticate so okay go log in I usually get this error not sure why I'm sure it's the uh, my SQL server is going crazy it, or timeout but once I refresh everything goes it works like it should on this machine uh, as you can see I'm on the member action and I have here the content I added uh, over here so I added this member page and that's what I'm getting back so as you can see it's really simple to add a, a section just for members uh, obviously anybody right now who can register anybody that goes into register once they log in they will see the member uh, information but on next video we can uh, restrict who can register uh, and what kind of accounts uh, or roles can view the members tab so hopefully this was, was a helpful uh, short video remember adding, adding this attribute will restrict a page uh, from showing up to the public uh, thank you for watching uh, this video and uh, be ready to see more about mvcasp.net